to our channel, Exploring It All. I'm Mariah Crisco. Join me and my dad while we explore subscription boxes, the outdoors, gear and equipment, and other fun things and places. Before we get started, hit like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell. Ding! Thank you for watching! Well, thank you very much for that amazing introduction, Miraculous Girl, and thank you everyone for joining us again here on Exploring It All. So today is September 4th. It is 100 plus degrees outside. I've been outside cutting down rogue trees, as I call them. They're trees that weren't deliberately planted, but just happened to grow uh, from seed droppings from neighbor's trees and things, and some of them didn't grow in good spots, and they're taking out fences and stuff. They're gonna be firewood. Anyway, so today we have Opaco Box. No, not Opaco Box. Creek Stewart's Survival Patch of the Month Club. Sur Creek Stewart's Survival Patch of the Month Club. It's $8 a month. Every month he sends you a patch and we've been getting a sticker, a patch and a sticker. Now, for those of you that don't know, I also unboxed Opaco Box Plus in August and my August Opaco Box had this face drawn on the inside of the box lid. I am certain that one of Creek's children, uh, I think his daughter's name is Lily, and his son's name is River, one of them drew this. Unfortunately, they didn't sign their artwork, so I don't know. Could have been Lily, could have been River, I don't know. Anyway, that's why this is here. So we got the patch of the month. I'm gonna open this, and I'm actually gonna use, I was gonna use my knife of the month from another sub, but instead I'm gonna use this Gerber tool that we got in Opaco Box just to cut the final portion of this. I took my mailing label off, but just to cut the final portion of this so we can get it all out. So, oh, that's really sharp. I hope I didn't cut anything important. And I got a neat little trick to do with uh, last month's thing of making your own survival kit was the survival skills challenge. I here it is, Patch of the Month Club. We always get this little card in here, talks about being a member of the Patch of the Month. Now we have this time, and you know, I mentioned getting a sticker, and this time we didn't get a sticker, but there is a, this is a different patch, and I like this style better. It, the patch, this is about the patch. I guess I'll read this as I show it to you. I like this patch, it's really cool. I take this little backing off of it, you get the packing. So here's the patch. Trust me, I'm a survivalist and they're wearing the gas mask. And this is that, do they call it PVC style? The first a few that we've gotten were stitched. This one is, you know, they were cloth. This is not an embroidered style one, this is the uh, PVC, I think they call them, morale style patch, which is awesome. I like this style of patch. You get a lot more clarity out of it. Um, there's no sticker this month though. I did say we've been getting a sticker and this time we didn't get one. Now, uh, the write-up on this says, this month's patch features a gas mask accompanied by a humorous phrase. Trust me, I'm a survivalist. It's a playful nod to the serious business of being prepared for anything. The detailed design captures the essence of survivalists who always stay ready for the unexpected. And speaking of unexpected, this patch was a special feature you'll discover when the lights go out. <laughs> nice! It's gonna glow in the dark! I love it. Uh, I will try and do a glow in the dark insert now. All right, and so, yeah, it glows. Let's see, and speaking of unexpected, this patch has a special feature that we'll discover when the lights go out. It's a perfect reminder that sometimes in survival and in life, there's more than meets the eye. Wear it with pride and a sense of humor because even the toughest situations, a little lightheartedness can go a long way. And that is very true. Laughter can make situations better. So now, I, like I said, I, I have a little trick here. I like this. I wonder what parts, I bet all the yellow stuff glows. That's awesome. 
All right, so here's a little trick. You want to be careful. You don't want to cut too hard. Cut along there and open this up in the back. Now you have a little pocket. You have a little pocket in the back of your patch. What can you do with that little pocket? Well, a lot of times, depending on what kind of subscriptions you have. Now, depending on the size of your patch, you've got this little pocket back here now, and you can put one of these little Grim Workshop tools in here. Or maybe two. This is a saw one. So now you have two tools hidden in your survival patch and you take this patch and stick it on and boom, you're good to go. But that's a little trick you can do with your patches. There's a, they, are, they can be a survival kit as well, which is a really neat little feature. You can also put it on something that doesn't um, have the hook and loop fasteners. You just sew this on there and then you can stick it on your jackets or whatever that don't have the hook and loop on there or backpacks, whatever you want to sew it on. But anyway, so that's a look at this month's Patch of the Month Survival Patch. Survival Patch of the Month Club. I think this is awesome. I love it. I like that patch. Again, this is eight bucks a month. Go to his website, creeksteward.com, I believe, something like that. So if you want to get it, eight bucks a month, that's, that's all it costs. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Remember, hit, like, subscribe, and be nice to each other. Oh, I guess